In this video, I'm going to be showing you Leptin Search, which is an open source project that allows you to easily build out your own version of Perplexity. So what's neat about this project is not only is it open source, but it allows you to integrate it with a number of different search engines. So you can integrate it with Bing or Google Search. I'd imagine there will be other options as well in time. So just a quick overview of the project. There's an Apache 2 license for the project itself. It has built-in support for multiple LLMs as well as multiple search engines, you can easily customize the UI since it's built in a familiar TypeScript environment. It also has the ability within the implementation that you're able to share and cache the search results. So say if you want to pass the link to someone like you can on a service like Perplexity, you can do that within this as well. It gives you a couple of options where you can get started with a search engine. So if you're using Bing, you can head over to Bing and get your web search API. Or if you're going to be using Google search, there's a few different services where you can get started. So you can use this search API, Serper, or you can use Google's API itself to get started. To get this all installed, you can go ahead, pip install everything thing and then choose the specific steps for the API key that you chose. The one thing to note is with a number of these API keys, you are able to get a handful of free requests if you're looking to try this out. One option I did want to point out with this service is Leptin AI does give you the ability to deploy these AI applications on their hosted platform. So if you're not looking to manage servers or do all the DevOps work on actually setting up all these different things on provisioning the servers, getting the LLM set up, making sure you have enough compute, scaling it, all of those different things, Leptin AI does give you the ability to sign up for a basic plan where you'll be able to explore a handful of different templates where you can go ahead and deploy different apps just like the Leptin search like I had showed you. You can go in, click this, you can set up your API keys within this, and then you can go ahead and deploy it. So I'd encourage you to take a look at Leptin, explore what they have to offer. There's a number of different things that you can do within here. So you can deploy that search interface like I had shown you within the example, or you can deploy a Mixtral endpoint or a Mistral endpoint if you'd like. They even have stable diffusion within here or deploying a whole stable diffusion UI if you'd like. So there's a ton of different things that you can do within Leptin AI. I just wanted to show you another tool that you could find interesting and potentially useful depending on the use case that you're exploring. So that's it for this video. If you found this video useful, please like, comment, share, and subscribe. And otherwise, until the next one.